My man, I Chef Morocco, is gonna be making the couscous. And we go! Yeah! Hi everybody! Hello everybody, welcome to Cuisine Arts. Uh, this is my brother Emil. Hello. Uh, Emil is an expert in uh, Moroccan food. He's been cooking some mean Moroccan dishes. I've been to his house so many times. Every time I come in, he's whipping up something else in Moroccan, <laughs> man. Okay. All right. So today, Emil is going to make us uh, a nice uh, Moroccan chicken Go ahead. couscous. Okay, so what you do first is we get a pot like that. Uh, it's like uh, 10 inches long. Uh, in diameter, right? You fill it up half with and water. You right? let it boil. No. All okay. right. Okay, so you got your bo water boiled. Right. You get your chicken base, right? The chicken, right? And you throw it. So we got our chicken and base. And make sure that it, uh, it dissolves well. Yeah, right. which you did. Okay. Uh, the next thing we're gonna throw is the vegetables. Okay. So here goes the. We're gonna start with the pumpkin. So we going to drop approximately a pan in. of pumpkin yes that's great okay. then some carrots Got a, a pound of carrots then we're going to do a couple cloth of garlic oh, just for taste the next thing we're going to do is the turnip the turnips it's they are about a pound of turnips yes yeah. Use your, right. your imagination and your logic right. for this food. You That's know. a pound of onion approximately, one pound of onion. Kakon. That's uh, about a teaspoon of... A uh, teaspoon of kakon. Of kakon, which is a turmeric. Yes, I just, uh, you know, do it with fingers. Right. This food is not so precise. You could do whatever you like. Right. right, so that's a can, and one can of cheap food. In the, in the last half hour. Right. There we go. Uh, now we take the chicken. Approximately, I would say maybe uh, two pounds of chicken uh, thighs and legs. Right. Up. Thighs and legs, right? That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Two pounds yeah. of chicken and legs goes right into the pot. There you go. It's a kind of, it's a kind of dish that everything goes in all together in one pot. Shubh khadari. Yes, shubh khadari, that's what we're doing. Okay, I'm going to get some black pepper in that. Te teaspoon of black pepper. Okay, throw it in. And of course, a tablespoon, a tablespoon of, of salt. salt. Great. Use and you got to let it cook for how yeah. long? Use your feelings. I'm sure you'll know. And how long are you going to let it cook? Uh, that beautiful concoction? Uh, I think it's... You should put it about for an hour. For about an hour. You can cook for about an hour. Uh, an hour to an hour and 15 until, minutes. Until the... Uh, when you feel the chicken is ready to eat and it's nice and tender. tender. Even falling out of the bowl. Of the bowl, yeah. Now that we got that great yeah. chicken going. Uh, now that we got love, what right. are we going to do with it? Ach, Okay, so this is what it looks like uh, after great. cooking. You see the colors, they're beautiful. Yeah, so an, so, hour, so an hour, uh, an hour after cooking. Right. Then you're going to add the uh, zucchini and the chickpeas. Uh, now we're going to add the uh, zucchini and chickpeas. And the zucchini, of great. course. So there we go. Yeah. Here goes the chickpeas. In. Right. And we're going to add the zucchini. And we're going to cook it for another half an hour after this. Great. Or 15 minutes, whatever. Zucchini don't need to cook. Okay. We decided to add the sweet uh, it's optional, you don't have to put it on a So we pull in uh, two boxes of couscous into the pot here. Flat okay. down, flat. The next things we need to do is uh, get the hot soup. How many cups uh, do you uh, have here? We have three uh, cups of uh, hot uh, soup right from the couscous, the juice from the couscous. Okay, have. great. There it goes right into the pan of the couscous. So we pour all at once, huh? You know, just pour it in. All at once. once. And uh, make sure it's covering everything. That will be couscous. Okay, so time. we put the soup in. And now we cover it for five minutes. Uh, yeah. To Let steam it. all by itself. Great. And then we're going to see the results. Beautiful, fluffy. Okay, now that you we uh, put the soup in there and let it steam for uh, five minutes. So we're going to fluff it. Which means you take a fork and you just fluff it down. Nice. So it's kind of nice and fluffy. Yeah, it's nice and fluffy. It's beautiful. 
Yeah, bring it to the camera and show okay, right here. So there you are. There you go. Let's see that closer. Close, you know. There you, go. you could see oh. it's uh, the clusters of grain. Nice. nice. Very nice. So there we are. Traditional okay. Moroccan couscous. So it's basically it's done. We're gonna pour the uh, soup and the chicken on top of each plate or the whole collective or, platter, thing, or, piece of platter. or anything you like and just serve in manja. So manja, you take manja. the couscous and you put it in the nicest platter you have. That's very nice. And you put it down like Look at that. that. Beautiful couscous. It's wow. just gorgeous. Uh, here so nice and really fluffy. Gorgeous looking. So what we do, we uh, take the uh, we, we, we take the veggies and we spread them around like that. That looks nice. Look, isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful Look looking that, dish. Man. We're going to put some chicken. Check it out. I'm going to put some more veggies and more chicken. Mm -hmm. And there we go. There you go. Isn't that gorgeous? Check it out. Uh, let me nice. show it to you close up right here on the dish. Oh, yeah. uh, okay, right there. Oh, look at that beautiful dish. Look yeah. at that beautiful piece of chicken right there. And it's absolutely Very delicious. nice. Bon appetit. Bon appetit.